o'clock Saturday afternoon, headed down to the Conecuh National Forest in the southern part of the state of Alabama to do a, just a quick overnighter. Um, haven't been out in a while and um, to, to do really any hiking or camping to speak of, and so uh, decided to try to sneak away for a night uh, by myself and uh, just uh, get out on the trail, do a little hiking, do a little backpacking. Uh, it's, there is a chance of rain this afternoon, uh, even possibly a, a thunderstorm maybe, but it's supposed to move on through uh, before mid to late afternoon, so I'm hoping that uh, it won't be, won't be anything too bad, but uh, it's supposed to clear up tomorrow, so tomorrow's supposed to be better. So I'm going to do maybe a little bit of, of the trail this evening and camp somewhere along the trail and then uh, do the rest of it, possibly the rest of it tomorrow. I think it's about 25-ish miles, 20 to 25 miles, the whole trail, but it's in two loops, I think. So I may just do... Um, one of the loops may do both of them if I have time we'll just see but uh, to start out with I'm just gonna uh, do a little short section of the trail maybe this afternoon and then spend the night I've never been down to the Conecuh National Forest never done the trail down there so I really don't know what the uh, trail looks like so we'll see uh, we've had some rain over the last week or so so it's probably gonna be wet but um, Otherwise, I don't know what the trail is going to look like. I read some reviews on it. Uh, several people gave it some pretty positive reviews, so I think it'll be a nice uh, little overnight trip. I made it to Open Pond Recreation Area here at Conecuh in the Conecuh National Forest, and my intentions were to hike somewhere and camp for tonight. But to be honest with you, I don't know exactly where the trail is. I, if my intentions were to find the office and get a map so and I didn't find it I've been driving around a little while and I hadn't found it so I did find the open pond recreational area which is really just a campground area and it does have a nice place to fish as you can see here but uh I don't know exactly where the trail runs so I'm just gonna spend the night here tonight there's a couple nice trees I'm gonna pick out here and overlook the uh, this beautiful pond and so I'm gonna spend the night here and see what I can find tomorrow as far as hiking trails so Ostentatious, ostentatious tortilla soup. Tortilla soup. So that's what we're having. So let's get going. Alright, what do we got here? We got some corn chips, some cheese. Looks like this is the actual soup mix. And then we have. Some, uh, some lime, some savory chicken flavored broth concentrate, and a little Cholula hot sauce. So 
So that's all the ingredients. Needs 12 ounces of water, so let's get some water going. 12 yeah. ounces of water. Put that there. And let's see. Typically takes about an ounce, a little under an ounce, so let's go with let's go with about an ounce since uh, since we're gonna bring it to a boil and then let it uh, simmer a little, so get it right at an ounce. Alright, let's get this going. Light the stove. All right, we're starting to get, not quite a bowl, but we're starting to get some bubbles around the side, so I'm going to go ahead and, and pour this in. Now, stir that in. And also put in the savory chicken broth. Some pretty thick, concentrated chicken broth there. It's the same stuff they use in some of their other meals. The chicken and dumplings, I think, use it and a few others. Packet Gourmet makes good stuff. I, uh, I really like it. It's a little pricey, so I don't always buy it, but... Um, but I like it though. So I'm gonna give this one a shot tonight. I've had a lot of their good stuff. A lot of stuff from them is pretty good. We'll see if it thickens up any. It says it's a soup, so it may not get real thick, but click the rice is in there and some beans, some little pieces of chicken, corn. Man, this is going to be good stuff here. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and add this lime. It hadn't been off the fire, but just a minute. I'm going to go ahead and put in the lime. Yeah, a little bit of this hot sauce here. Cholula hot sauce. Sprinkle a little bit of that in there. Not a whole lot, just a little bit. Not a huge hot sauce fan, but put a little bit of that in there. And let's go ahead and... Mm, that's good stuff there, that hot sauce. It's not too bad. Go ahead and add the cheese. Okay, we'll let that sit there and rehydrate for a bit. The cheese can melt. And uh, then we'll... Uh, Put the corn chips in and give it a shot. So I'll be back in a minute, let you know how it tastes. All right, let's see what we got here. Still warm. Mmm, that's good. That's good soup, good stuff. Packet Gourmet's Ostentatious Tortilla Soup. I'd say I'd give it about a six out of a 10. Maybe even a seven. Good. All right, so the hammock's hung back up. I think the weather's going to be okay now. So I went ahead and put the hammock back up. I've got a couple people out, a couple boats out there fishing now. So I guess they think the weather's cleared up too, so they're back out on the water. Mm -hmm. 